In this video, we're going over some penny coins from 1999 that sold for a lot of money, just like this coin right here that sold for $138,000. This is a quick video, but stay until the end so you can see exactly why this one sold for so much money. But to start off, let's look at this coin that looks like it got obliterated. They're selling online for $1,000. Now keep in mind that you're not going to be able to replicate this error with a hammer, so don't try to do anything like that. Even though it looks like it got destroyed post-factory, this is indeed a genuine mint error coin. They're calling this a huge B over S double indention on the reverse of the coin. Pretty much what you need to know here is that if you find a coin like this, it's worth sending it off to a company like PCGS or NGC to get it graded and certified and authenticated so you can sell it online for a lot of money just like this person's doing for a thousand dollars. Here's a coin that sold for one thousand nine hundred and eighty dollars. This is a 1999 one cent coin that was accidentally struck on a ten cent planchet. By planchet we just mean piece of metal the coin is struck on. Pretty much there's a couple ways to tell if you have one of these coins. One, the size is going to be incorrect when you measure it. Two, the weight is going to be wrong. And three, the color is obviously going to be the wrong color. If you have one of these coins, make sure to get it graded and certified because 1980 bucks for this coin. Now here's a coin that sold for $138,000. Now really quickly, if you have a rare coin, there's a few ways we recommend about getting it appraised. One option you have is sending us in our community a picture of the coin or paper money and we will appraise it for you. To learn more about that, click the link below, but you do not have to do that whatsoever. The second option is to spend the time researching on your own and finding at least three different coin experts around you and bringing those coins to them to see how much it's actually worth. Now keep in mind, if your coin is rare and valuable, they will tell you. If all three coin shops say that your coin is not rare, trust them. Believe them. They're not trying to rip you off and scam you. Keep this in mind. The majority of coins out there are not rare and valuable. I know that's a hard pill to swallow for a lot of people, but just because you see a rare coin in our video does not mean you have that exact coin. So why did this coin sell for $138,000? Well, it's because when you flip the coin over, you can see the back was accidentally struck with a Roosevelt dime reverse. This is something that you cannot replicate. It's going to be very easy to tell if you try to fake it, but if you have one, get it certified, authenticated, and graded, and then you can sell it for a lot of money online, just like this person did for $138,000. Again, check out the link below if you want to learn more about our membership. It's completely affordable, and you can cancel at any time, but more on that in the link below, and we'll see you in the next video.